Good afternoon, sir. My name is Julia Ramos, 19 years old, and I'm currently studying at Pan Pacific University Tayug Campus, Bachelor of Secondary Education major in English. And this is my lesson plan. because we will go in the sanitizer hand. Okay. Okay, next. Next. Okay, go back to your seats. Stand up and lead the prayer, Anna. Amen. Good morning, class. Okay. Give me the attendance. Who is absent for today? Okay. Seems like all of you are present. Okay. Are you ready for our discussion and our new topic for today? Okay. Can anyone tell me what we discussed yesterday? Okay. Very good, Carl. It's a literary piece of I Am Filipino by Carlos P. Romulo. Another one? Okay, excellent done. It's all about sensory images. Can you give me an example of sensory images? Okay, class, do not answer me on chorus. Quiet, I will be choosing you individually. Okay, Vince, it says up. Oh, Hi, very good. Amy. Okay, sense of hearing. Another one. Alex. Sense of taste. Another one. Angel. Sense of touch. Very good. And Bea. Sense of smell. That's right. Every one of you got it all correct. Okay. Great job, everyone. It seems like all of you are ready for our next activity. I will divide you into four groups. And you will determine the symbolical meaning of the pictures that I will be giving to you. Okay, you go there. There. Also there. Okay, there. Okay, group one. Group two, group three, and lastly, group four. Okay, class, you may now start determining the photos I've given to you. I will be giving five minutes for you to finish that. Okay, are you done? Okay, very good, group one. Group four, okay. Next. Okay, group three. And lastly, group two. Okay, pass your papers. And now, I will discuss you everything I've given to you right now. First, it's coconut. And very good, group one. Sense of... Taste great. Fresh buku juice. From the word is that fresh buku juice, it refers to our sense of taste because it's refreshing, right? Okay, thank you. Next, group two. Spear. Very good. It's sense of touch because from the sentence, it may kill its dream. Okay, you're going to kill someone because. Okay, very good. And it's sense of touch because you're going to feel something. Okay, healing is, okay, it may hurt you. And sense of touch. Okay, group three. It's rose. Okay, sense of smell 
because because it smells good. If you prefer sour, it's fragrance. Okay. Lastly, group four. This is dumb. Okay. It's the sense of sigh because the dove you saw it flap its wings. So you saw flap its wings. So it's sense of sigh. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good, everyone. Go back to your proper seats. Okay, be quiet. Are you ready for our next discussion? Good. So listen carefully. Now, class, bring out your assignments because yesterday I told you to have advanced reading about symbolism. Okay, thank you, Mark. Pass your notebooks. Yes, I will check it later on. Put it here. Okay. I told you yesterday that you're going to have advanced reading for our next topic. And our next topic is symbolism. Okay. So, on the blackboard, what is symbolism? Okay, oh, come on, read this. Symbolism is the use of symbols to signify ideas and qualities by giving them symbolic meaning that are different from their literal sense. An event or a word spoken by someone may have a symbolic value. Okay, example, can you please read Mark? Okay. Smile is a symbol of friendship. Okay, if you are going to have your friend, are you going to be mad? Of course not. You're going to be happy and smile as always. That's a symbolic meaning of a friendship. Smile. Okay, another example. Very good. Black is a symbol that represents evil or death. Nice one, Angela. Okay, another one. Okay, Bea, very good. A broken mirror symbolizes separation. Nice one. Okay, now tell me what is sensory images or imagery. Can you please read the sentence? Okay, Christopher. Okay, sensory image or imagery means to use figurative language to represent objects, actions, and ideas in such a way that it appeals to our physical senses. Okay, example. Okay, and it was dark and dim in the forest. Okay, the word dark and dim are visual images. Okay. Okay, another example. Rumel. Sniff the aroma sense of coffee. Okay? You smell the aroma or the fragrance of the coffee. That's the sense of smell. Very good, Rumel. Okay. Now, plus. Let's recall our discussion for today. Again, what is symbolism? Very nice, Joy. How about sensory images? Good job, Myra. Can you please enumerate the five senses? Okay, and hearing. Okay, Angelo. Says, Bea. Touch and smell. And the last one, okay, Carl, is sight. Okay. And lastly, can you give me an example of symbolism? Okay, nice one, Bell. Before I end the class for today, I will be giving you assignments. Do this in your home and we're all done for today. 
fall in line and get your assignments. Okay, before we may go, clean all your stops and close the window, especially remove the sockets, okay? And we're all done for today. Thank you everyone. Have your great day. Be productive and goodbye. Bye class.